Hey, my name is Dr. Chill. Today, I'm going to be giving you a full ear exam. Lee's ear exams are vitally important, so it's, it's very good to have you here today. So, this ear exam is going to be split up into four different parts. Firstly, I'm going to be asking you just a few questions um, just about your hearing and your ears in general. The second part is a visual inspection of both of your ears. So I'll be wearing gloves for this and just very gently checking around both of your ears for any problems or anything we should be concerned about. The third part of this examination is uh, ear cleaning. So I will be cleaning both of your ears just to um, help get rid of any excess earwax or dirt or any of that bad stuff. And finally, I'm going to be giving you a bit of a hearing test. So I have a few different items beside me which I'm going to be uh, tapping around your head. Um, this is just going to be a bit of a test to see how well you can hear those sounds. So, shall we begin? Okay. So, um, I have a few questions for you. Um, nothing too in-depth or, or detailed. Just some basic questions. So... <clears throat> Have you um, had any ear infections or, or any pain around your ears in the last year or so? Okay, let me just write that down. Okay. Mm, okay. Hmm. So you had uh, what you think to be an ear infection about six months ago, is that correct? Okay, and was it was it painful? Mm, very much so. Yeah, ear infections can be really annoying and painful. Um, the fact that yours only lasted about two weeks is, is probably a good thing. Um, did you come and get any medication for it? Did you see, see a doctor? Okay, so you saw a doctor and he prescribed you some antibiotics and it seemed to work. Okay, cool. Hmm, okay. Antibiotics. Great. Um, so, again, over the last year or so, have you experienced any noticeable hearing loss at all. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, well, that's correct. Um, as we age, our hearing tends to get a bit worse. Um, so, uh, we all lose our hearing to some extent. Um, uh, you said you work as a builder in a building site, is that correct? Okay. So I'm guessing when you're working on a building site, you tend to experience some quite loud sounds throughout the day, is that correct? Hmm, okay. Um, do you ever wear the correct uh, PPI? Okay, so you wear ear defenders when you're working. That, that's very good. Yeah, um, so when you're exposed to uh, that kind of uh, heavy machinery and a loud working environment, um, it can be have quite a very significant effect on your hearing, so it's good that you're wearing the correct uh, protection. Okay, and um, do you happen to uh, visit doctors for ear exams on a regular basis? Or is this your first one? Okay. Okay. Mm, okay. So, um, 
I do highly recommend uh, coming to these ear exams on a on a yearly basis if possible. Like I said earlier, they are vitally important. Um, good way of me being able to check um, if there's any problems which uh, may need uh, treatment or trying to prevent any further um, hearing loss. So um, yeah, if you can try and come on, on a yearly basis, that would be, it would be very beneficial for you. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna finish up with my notes and we'll begin. of this ear exam is a visual inspection of your ears. So um, I'm going to be very gentle. I'm just going to be looking around your ears to see if I can see any problems or anything we should be concerned about. I'm going to wear some gloves as always. Okay. on okay so like I said this will be very gentle you might even find it relaxing who knows so I just need you to stay as still as possible um, is it okay if I do touch around your ears and your face is that fine Okay, now I just need you to tilt your head to the right a bit so I can have uh, a bit of a closer look. Okay. Okay. Just taking a look. Just taking a look. Around. Just gonna have a look around your other ear now. Um, again, I promise to be very gentle.
So everything seems absolutely fine, nothing to be concerned about so far. Okay, actually now I'm going to keep these gloves on for the ear cleaning. I just need to take a few notes first there. Okay, so everything seems exceptional. Did you feel any kind of discomfort or pain while I was checking your ears? No? Good. So yeah, we always make sure we wear gloves when uh, touching uh, your ears because it's very easy to pass on bacteria and germs which then can cause infection. So we always make sure we've got a protective barrier on when doing these kind of exams. the third parts of the exam now. I'm going to be uh, giving your ears a bit of a clean. So I've got some uh, cleaning equipment here, got a bit of a q-tip and I've got some cleaning fluid which um, I'm going to put on one end of the q-tip um, just to help clear out any excess wax or, or dirt, any of that bad stuff. Again, I don't think this is going to cause you any such discomfort. Um, I'll be very gentle and um, just try and make sure I get as, as rid of as much uh, dirt as I can. Okay? So, please just uh, stay still again and I'm going to start uh, cleaning your ears. Just going to actually apply some of this cleaning fluid on here first. Just going to coat it around just to help provide some, some liquid in there to help flush out everything. Okay, so if you want to just stay as you are, maybe just tilt your head to the right a bit. I'm going to start cleaning your left ear. Okay, just relax.
Okay, perfect. Thanks for staying so still there. So, your ears are nice and clean now. Um, you should probably notice um, quite an instant effect on your hearing. Um, it's certainly a very good way of just cleaning out everything. And um, yeah, okay. I'm going to take my gloves off. Okay, so we're on to the fourth part of this ear exam now. I have um, three different items which um, I'm going to be tapping on all around your head. So the aim of this is to test how well your hearing is at the moment. Um, what I need you to do is once I've tapped on the trigger around your head, I need you to give me a rating out of 10 as to how well you can hear. So uh, one being you can't hear it at all, it's completely inaudible and 10 being it's absolutely perfect. Is that okay? Cool. So I'm just going to start off with this black box here. Um, I'm going to be very gently just tapping it around your head. Um, just try and just close your eyes and um, just focus in on the sounds that it makes. Okay. Okay, just have a listen. See how well your ears react to this sound. Okay, just around a bit more, from ear to ear, just testing your hearing. Okay, so out of 10, how well do you think you could hear that sound then. Okay, so about a seven. So yeah, you can hear it quite well then. Okay. Hmm. Oh, so you think the ear cleaning has had an effect on your hearing. It feels a bit more, more clear. That's good, that's good to know. Okay, so got the next item here. It's a crowd favourite. It's just a simple Doritos dip jar. Hey, it sounds pretty good and it tastes equally as nice. But what I need you to do, like last time, just close your eyes and uh, tune in on the sounds that it makes and see how well you can hear this trigger.
Okay, so, um, how well did you hear that sound? Okay, a four. Okay. Yeah, you see that sound was a bit more of a high frequency. As we get older, um, our ears uh, are less attuned to hearing that kind of frequency, so um, that's probably why you can hear it as much. But um, a four isn't too bad for that uh, that sound. Some people can barely hear that when I do the same tests on them. Okay, the final sound I have for you is a nice mixture of the two sounds previously quite a medium frequency so um let's see how well you can hear this one Okay. Okay, so um how well did you hear that one? Okay, a six, that's that's okay. That's about average for that trigger. Yes, your your hearing seems to be seems to be really good. Um, I don't see any kind of signs of any thing we should be concerned about. Um, your hearing seems to be seems to be as good as it should be, and I can't see any kinds of problems um, for my visual inspection earlier. So I think all in all, I think uh, your ears are in very good shape, as well as your hearing. So. Um, yeah, that's all good. Yes. If you um, ever feel like coming to visit me for anything in the future, any kind of problems you have with your hearing or ears, and please don't hesitate to come and visit me. Anyway, it was good to see you today, and um, I'll see you around.